Your little baby said I could sleep. Yeah, he could sleep. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Good morning, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if it's your first time here. My name is Rebecca. I'm so happy to have you here today for another day in the live vlog. I am a mom of three if you're new here. Um, my oldest will turn three in January and then I also have twin babies um, that are now three months old. Um, yeah, it is 8.30 right now and um, the baby shut down for the first nap upstairs in the crib and I'm getting breakfast ready finally. I'm a little late today. Um, yeah, it's just really simple oatmeal with um, mashed bananas and peanut butter. That's why I'm looking over here because I have my oatmeal on the stove top. Um, I just stir it. Um, I have some coffee ready and then I'm just having breakfast with Paulina. And yeah, then I will give you a little update again or just take you along. I'm gonna let the sun shine in. Make this darkness go away I'll paint with colors And I'll sing until my lungs give out I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day And I will leave my windows open So that I can hear the sound of people talking Starts to fade, feels 
like things are gonna go my way And I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day I'm gonna let the past be filled with smoke And I will try to fix what has been broken And take this weight off my shoulders Cause I know yesterday ain't coming back Jetzt guck ich hier, was ist denn da? Ah, Mama ist da. Hi. We have a little toy chaos over here. I don't know. We had a play date yesterday. And I took out a few more toys from the basement. But now, yeah. Um, um, yeah. And now she starts packing it. Oh my goodness. But I hear Mariella upstairs. I will just have a quick look if she goes back to sleep and then we maybe tackle some of this mess. Okay, so right now I'm nursing the babies. Um, I had to wake them up because we got to leave in a few minutes for my sports. And Polly and I go to the like uh, children's care, daycare they have there. Um, yeah, and I will take the babies with me. That's possible there. And yeah, I would just nurse them, change your diapers, and get out of the door.
All three babies are sleeping. I'm so happy I'm not... I shouldn't say that out loud, probably. I will just sit down, have lunch. I'm exhausted actually after my sport lesson and getting all three children there and all buckled up in the car and then back and everybody to bed. Lunch. Paulina is in bed way too late today. Normally she goes to bed at like 12, 12 30. It's already 1 30. So yeah, we will see. I hope that everybody will sleep for the next hour. Um, yeah, and I would just sit down, have a break, have my lunch in peace and do probably nothing, maybe do some planning, um, but that's it. And in one and a half hours, my grocery will get, groceries will get delivered. So that's the next thing on the agenda, next to getting the kitchen cleaned up and the laundry switched. Yeah, we will see. <laughs> Okay, it is 3.45 now, all babies are up from their naps, um, I got all the diapers changed and I feel so, so bad. I was thinking about if we would talk about that here, but I'm trying to be more real on my YouTube channel, even though this is, oh my goodness, really hard for me sometimes. Um, yeah. Um, I think I got a clip where it was like the babies woke up like 30 minutes after I um, put them to bed and I just went upstairs and thought okay I would nurse them again and then I was not sure if they would sleep good enough to put them in their bed again so I just thought okay maybe they would sleep half an hour if I put them right into the bed next to me just stay there have a little break as I already planned and yeah just watch something call with them um, yeah and I fell asleep. I am so overtired at this point of having twin babies and like the last night was not good at all. Um, yeah, and my groceries would have gotten delivered if I would have opened the door or yeah, went on the phone because they called me and they rang the bell several times. I don't know why well, a dog was not barking or something like that. Pony wasn't waking up. Nobody was waking up. I was not hearing it. Probably because we have white noise on in the baby's room where they sleep. Yeah. And then I called them like 10 minutes after they were here. And they will probably come later. But oh, I feel really not good about that. Yeah. And these two. I don't know. Okay. You just need entertainment. You're not really cranky. You just need entertainment. Huh? Henry. Okay, he's looking at the camera like, what is that? Okay, my husband came home and he just left with Paulina and Ellie to go to the vet appointment to see how Ellie's paw is doing and yeah. Ah, 
Harry. <laughs> you cannot do that. You can turn around. as well, huh? Huh? I actually don't know what happened like she was the one who was always so unhappy with tummy time and she was pretty, doing pretty good but right now it just changed and she is doing really well and he is uh, not feeling it <laughs> at all okay come here I'll help you I'll help you yeah oh yeah 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 Oh, it is so hard. <gasps> Hi. What is that? So we went on a short evening walk and it was just allowed to walk for 15 or 20 minutes and we just went all together as a family because the babies were a little cranky and then we came home and I cooked dinner which was gnocchi casserole that day and I was just yeah freestyling it. I used a meat a vegan meat substitute um, that I browned in the pan first and then took it out you could use ground beef ground whatever kind of meat you want um then i just used some red bell pepper and some zucchini let that saute for a while i also added some garlic and then i just used two cans of diced tomatoes some spices added the um, meat substitute back in then i added some cooked gnocchi to the casserole pan added the sauce on top uh, oh no, I added some sour cream to the sauce, as you can see here, yeah, I forgot about that. And then I added the sauce to the gnocchis and mixed it all together. Added some shredded cheese and then I also added a little bit of leftover Parmesan cheese that had to be used up, which made it really tasty. And 
yeah then i just baked it in the oven on like i think it was like 400 degrees something like that just a melted cheese um for like 15 minutes and it was a really yummy dinner which made a graft great leftovers so thank you so much for watching today's video i hope you enjoy it as always if you're new here make sure to hit that red subscribe button i would love to have you on my channel and i would love to see you in the next video have a beautiful rest of the week and yeah, see you soon. You talking? No, one for the camera, Mama. Oh. <laughs>